I'm very excited to share with you <clears throat> my latest two paintings, which are epic in the story of my life. I feel they're very, very important to share. The, this one here um, is the temple, it's about the temple that exists within and out and without all of us, with it outside the boundaries of where I, I am speaking as a story of my life, which is about becoming free. So in, in, the, in the forest of enchantment here, um, that the frames are expanding out of, that everything is growing into a new dimension. And so these are like windows to a, through a dream to become free through the joy of light. And, and the light is being given here in the, in the beginning, the light of, of spirit blessing all of us. And so the light rains down through this temple uh, shrine that where the canopy of the forest opens up to the light, letting that spirit now reign into the new dimensions and the new spaces of possibility that's opening up. And <clears throat> these are like, these pillars here are like Gaia's goddesses, the, the, the spirit of the trees, the feminine that gives, is now offering her protection to the dancer and to those enchanted ones that are dancing together now like a stream of light, bringing the orbs of these universes of new possibilities that are being given by the guardians of nature and the guardians of our dreams that are now reigning this, this rainbow light, this, this color mm -hmm. of, of spirit's uh, joy. And so there's a stream here where all creation is pouring down now into the dimension of earth, in, into the streams of water that are all raining with this new reflection. And so we have the guardians of nature, the, the light bearers, the, the ones who carry these orbs into, into the forest now to, to bond with the, the rainbow, to reflect that light off the bridge of the rainbows. The rainbows are pouring the light through these windows, these frames that are opening their boundaries to the color of new, new expressions. So now we see the dance herself coming on this ribbon, this ribbon that is carrying her through the rainbows streams, bringing the night rainbow into the day. And so it's, it's a celebration. All, all of nature is celebrating this new beginning and this new giving of, of the waters now into the sea of, of all of us. All the droplets of all the dimensions now are forming this great current and the current is being propelled by the release of the, of the center of the earth. So we have here this, this volcanic eruption, but the eruption is like fireworks, like celebration. The, the 4th of July, in a sense, that now becomes our liberation time. And so it's... It's saying that this is the time when we can all come together and be a part of this great current of blessing the waters and blessing every drop of what we're made of so that nature is cleansed and we are all flowing 
freely on these orbs like universes of possibilities now blending with the waters, the crystal waters of, of our essence. And so here she goes into the flow that goes into the room and just keeps going. A portal of love resides in everyone. A place where that dream of uniting with our spiritual partner can happen again, can happen for us, that reunion. And so there is this place that transcends all time and space that goes beyond the dimensions of this world through many lifetimes for all of us, I believe, where there is this gateway, this gateway that is protected by the Sphinx, the two guardians of, of that whole opening to the other side. And we can only come through it when we are ready. She is ready now. She is vulnerable. She is naked in her purity. She is holding her, her heart, her solar plexus in, in protection. <clears throat> she is royal from another time. In her, in her crown, crown in, their, in this crown is made of the sea, of the sea's uh, coral, made of white coral, because she comes from that sea of dreams. His crown, his crown is composed of the sea too, of sea urchins from a very sacred island in the Galapagos. And there are crystals in here and pearls and emerald and rubies too, to activate the, the, the crown chakra. The crown chakra is part of the sun here, the sun's halo that they now give forth to give birth to the flower of life that is going forth into new universes of birthing the dreams that they are awakening for all of us. The dream now says the portal is opened and she is ready and her vulnerability and surrendering her, her love to, to his gentle beloved's touch, combing her aura and giving her healing. So he has this serpentine cloak that he wears, bringing transformation. So together now, they are awakening the warriors in themselves. The warrior spirit in the, all, in the mountains of two times that they come from, two places, the Andes, where the Machu Picchu of the crown, the, the Como Piton Mountains, that carries the Ancient One's guardianship, holding the secrets of their destiny, now a part of the structure of, of their history, can intersect with the, the, the warrior of Egyptian times, where the lakes of pure waters reside. So the Nile, in a sense, meets the, the wild rivers of Machu Picchu in this loving stream that pours through them. The stream that melts all the sharp stones of their separation. The walls now between them are opening up as this great water pours through them the water of spirit. The owl is, is her guardian of discernment, and the owl is happy, in a sense, for all the winged ones that now freedom's gate is opening. So we have here the top of the, the mountain, the piton of their, of their power now being ascended to the new heights. And so the journeyer, the, fem the woman who has journeyed here, she is the one who is in the lower section here, 
um, opening her heart to the power of the hitching post of the sun, of, of that place where the initiate comes in ascending the mountain of their, their life's journey. And so we have here the, the love pouring of the pink, the pink rose coloring that pours through them and through their hearts now get, being, giving streams to the universe and then giving back. So we have the, the, the crown of the frame now opens up. There's no more re, uh, restrictions, no more <clears throat> boundaries for them. They are now, like the flower of life, blossoming anew. <clears throat>